Hello viewers, welcome back to my channel. In this tutorial, I'm going to show some important settings in ArcGIS. You must know this setting for efficient use of ArcMap. Here you can see here table of content. See this pin tab. If we click it, then it will be fixed. If we click here again, then it will be height here. Now close this from here. You can add it this tool table of content click it now it, it will be appear here and here the arc toolbox now see the board tool here if we change the location now it will be like this okay and also for this if we change one time then you could not find again in the default setting now click it see this one here I want to set it back in this location so just double click here in this blue line double click here then it will be set again their default position and also for our toolbox just double click it here then it will be set it here now see this tool click it you can fix it, or you can set it here again also for this one here the catalog you can connect some folder or disconnect some folder if i want to disconnect it just right click and here the disconnect folder right click and disconnect folder if no need again so just right click and disconnect your folder or if we want to connect again any folder then just go to this folder connection tab and connect to folder then you can just select your folder or drive like i want to connect one folder so just click it here my data section i want to connect this data just click it ok then it will be connected to my connection folder here another important setting you should know about here the customize tab in the customize tab you can find arc map option see it you can understand if you add it here okay just see first i want to add one map here and my map section all shape file i want to add india new political map this is warning because this is a geographic coordinate system that's why here you can some setting here you know the two view one data view and one layout view this is a data view and this is a layout view you can set up this two view using this customize tab and arc map option click it here this is general section here you can find immediate add data if you click it then it will be added to your data immediately then this is most important in make relative path the default for new map document just check it and also for data view here you can find some important settings some here you can find here enable a continuous display updating during navigation if you navigate in your arc map then it will be continuously updated if you um, click it here now see here the important settings default labeling properties all time we need to set our font and label if, if you change it here uh, like I prefer always Times New Roman and font size 14 then it will be no need to change again and again here also layout view if I go with layout view see here in this layout view here this grid line I can add any grid line like this if you click this here this one then it will be add line then again the same way we can add the line here so this line in inches we can change it to semi and other unit just go to customize here the arc map option if your grid line not come in your arc map then you can add it here I have the guided grid margin everything you can add here or you can change it the unit from here the centimeter I want to add the centimeter at the smallest division 1 semi I can change it to 1 by 10 semi 
and also we can change it increase in horizontal spacing and vertical spacing okay now just click ok now see the difference now it is in semi so we can change it here and also some important setting here we have the raster data we can change raster catalog raster layer and mosaic data set make newly added mosaic layer expand it make boundary sub layer visible okay next i will discuss some other important settings for arcmap here in geo processing in this geo processing tab you can find here the environment setting and one geo processing option first i want to discuss about the environmental setting click it here now see most important thing here the workspace it automatically is detected in your one type or your c type you can change this path by clicking here you can save it anywhere instead of only c type i want to save it in my e type i can save it here okay just create one folder and just change the path then just click add and okay then it will be change it also other important setting here like another option here the processing extension you can change if you change it here the processing extension then no need to change again and again so these are the most important settings for arcmap also another important setting in geo processing option click it here now see this setting sometime your background processing is disabled if you click it this enable setting then it will be enable when some background processing is going on like here in this area it will be visible also you can uh, add result are temporary by default if you click it then your result will be long after two weeks then your temp file will be deleted automatically so here guys this important setting you can set your arc map then you can work easily